While the Biden administration is scrambling to understand the scope of the damage from the leaked top secret documents which give details of the Ukrainian military vulnerabilities among other things. But a closer look at these confidential documents show that the clock is ticking away. And Ukraine would soon run out of ammunition which could give Russia a much needed opening to launch a game changing offensive. Check this report for further details. For now, the NASAM's air defense systems are firing on all cylinders. Ukraine claims that the NASAMs have destroyed over 100 enemy missiles and drones. I think that in the near future, the anti-aircraft missile brigade will be armed with all the latest systems that will be in Ukraine. But the question is, for how long can Ukrainian troops keep the Russians at bay? Besides resisting the onslaught, Kiev has been planning a much-wanted counter-offensive. But now, all those plans have gone awry. According to a report, Ukraine has been forced to amend some military plans because of the leak of classified US documents. The Russian-installed head of Donetsk claims Russian forces controlled more than 75% of the besieged city of Bakhmut, a city which the Ukrainians have been fiercely holding on to till now. But things are about to change, which could give Moscow a decisive upper hand. For the last 13 months, Ukrainians have been successful to a large extent in keeping the Russian planes at bay. But the leaked US intel data shows that air defenses protecting troops on the front line could completely run out of ammunition by the third week of May. In all likelihood, the Russian Air Force is set to use this chunk in the armor to unleash its jets and bombers to pulverize the Ukrainian forces. In the early days of the war, Russian Air Force tried to pin down Kiev, but it had to change its plans due to the resistance from Ukrainian forces. But now, all that could change. While the West is determined to keep the supply lines open, Kiev is facing extreme difficulties in finding Soviet-designed ammunition for its crucial S-300 and the BUK batteries. Russia too has been looking at new avenues to keep supplying ammunition to the front lines. There have been reports of Russia's arsenal being bolstered by supplies from Iran and North Korea, a charge denied by all three countries. But now the same leaked US intel shows that Egypt planned to produce 40,000 rockets from Russia. The top secret document, dated February 17th, has details about gunpowder and artillery from Egyptian factories being manufactured for Russia. Clearly, the outcome of the war will depend on the speed and scope of Western deliveries and the ability of Russian air defenses to intercept this kind of weaponry. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One.